All right, check it out. I just received this in the mail and I got it because I wanted to look at some CDs. Um, to get it open, you just unscrew, unscrew it, unzip it. And it does come with this extra uh, cable, which is the old style, I do believe. We'll set that there. We don't really need that cable. Let me put this to the side. Here is the CD player, and here is the port. You're going to notice that this port is uh, the old style ports, like those old Samsungs, but you don't need that. What you're going to do is you're going to use this. You're going to pop this little this uh, USB-A out of here, and that's what you got to plug into your computer, okay? So we got to plug this in to the port in the back of my Mac, and then we should be able to just go ahead and open her up, throw a CD in there, and look at some photos. So let's do it. So anyway, I've got to put this DVD player close to this one side of the Mac, because back here is where our port is. I've got so much junk back here. And let's see if you can see it. Yeah, there it is. Now, you got a 50-50 chance of getting this in there, right? And guess what? We did it. We made it. All right, once you put that in there, then you should be able to um, see what's going on on the computer. Now, when you first do it, it doesn't show anything. So on a Mac, what you've got to do is you've got to put a CD in there. Once you put the CD in here, it'll pop up on there. So let's grab a CD. Well, I've got this old dojo pictures from a couple years back. I'm going to press this button. It should pop open. When it does, you can see right here, this is how it reads it. It reads the back of the CD. Make sure it's clean. And then I just set it in here. This is kind of a cheap thing here. It only cost me 29 bucks, I think. Then you push it down on this little thing here. It's like sets on it. Then I just push it in, just like that. And now we should see it pop up on the computer here on the screen. It takes a little couple minutes or seconds. I don't know. We'll see. You can hear it. It's making that loud noise as it reads. And there it is. See? And then I just take my cursor and I slide it over here. Just click on that. It should open up a window. And you can see it says photo library. Click on that. And I just go to modifieds. And I gotta go through it. And then we'll just well, we'll just open up this photo here. Press on here. And it opens up. Yeah, there it is. So now it's reading these photos, and I've got a whole bunch of them. And that's basically how it works. All right, so now if you want to get rid of it, what you would do is you would uh, basically come over here and uh, open up your finder, right? Open up your finder. And then I would just go down to photo library. It's kind of just basically tells me what, you know, whatever the CD was, it's going to be that name here. And so then I would just click on it and it just turns it off. And then if I want to get it out, I just, I, oh, it just pops right out like that. I don't even have to do anything. And then you pull it out, shut it, and bam, Bob's your uncle. You're ready to go. And that's it. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel. Check out my other awesome videos where I show you stuff like this right here. Peace out.